Hello there, it's Thursday, October 13th, and uh, I'm about to go into the Black Ad Haunted House. And Mr. Brad's with me for moral support. He's not going. I'm not going. He's not going. It's not his cup of tea. No, sir. No way. Nuh uh. Anywho, I'm actually kind of nervous this year because last year, you may remember, I had supermodel Kristen Quinn with me. Thank you, Mr. Han. And, um,. Even though we couldn't go through together, just knowing that she's back there and I was worried about what they were doing to her gave me something else to worry about than what they were doing to me. Plus, I pissed off the people that, that run the place because they saw a post where I told them that I told the Steampunk Haunted House that they were my favorite house from last year. Even though I gave them great credits anyway and told them how much you guys loved it, how much you guys wanted to hear about the uh, Blackout Haunted House. So they said, yeah, why don't you drop your name when you come in, Patrick from Screen Queens, and we'll be sure to give you a great time. So, yeah, I'm a little nervous. So, to prepare, we're having Cosmos. And it's gross, and it's rainy out, and I'm nervous, and um, hopefully if the rain holds off, I might want to talk to some people when they come out and get some on-spot interviews if I'm not, you know, Frightened. If I don't have diarrhea pants, is what I was gonna say. There are kids. The other next door. Oh, the other other next door. And here, Pip. Catch you on the flip side. Hey, it's me again. I'm standing here inside the lobby of the Blackout Lawn and House, waiting in line to get in. Uh, Mr. Brad has left the building. He's in the bar across the street. No, really, where I should be. Uh, I'm talking to some of these lovely people online here to see if they want to talk to me after they've gone through <laughs> their experience as well. See if I'm the only one who's shit and pickles. Which, by the way, right now I am shit and pickles. Uh, I think they're bread and butter, uh, bread and butter pickles. Bread and but I said bud. Okay. Yeah, so I gave the guys at the waiting desk my business card so they know that I'm here and they promised to be extra hard on me. So I'm very, very nervous. I said hard on. Okay, I don't know if I said this already, but one of the reasons I'm so concerned this year was because last year I had supermodel Kristen Quinn with me. So while I was in the house, I had something else to worry about besides what was going on with me in the house. So I'm all by myself now. I got no Mr. Brad. I got no supermodel Kristen Quinn. Taking us in one at a time. Every now and then there's a really loud whistle. And about two minutes later, they bring the next one in. There's one or two people in front of me. And then that. Good luck, kids. Hey, everybody. I survived. How about that? Uh, I didn't get to do any of the interviews I wanted to do. First of all, it was pelting rain by the time we got out, so nobody was able to stick around. And plus, Mr. Brad wasn't feeling well. He said he wasn't feeling well earlier this evening, and by the time I got out, he really, really wasn't feeling well. Mostly because he got drunk at the bar across the street while I was in the haunted house, but he was sick on top of that as well. Anyway, the house was amazing. It was very different from last year, and in the same way, very the same, very psychosexual, very violent, extremely violent this year. I got the crap beaten out of me. I mean, I said I got the crap beaten out of me last year, but you know, I don't know if my eye is still fucked up, but my eye got all fucked up. And this year, I got a souvenir. Can you see that? Do you know what that is? Do you know what they made me do with them? I'll tell you later. Because I've decided I'm not going to actually reveal any of the secrets of the Blackout Haunted House until after the season's over and they're closed. But I have to give it a huge recommend. If you're in the New York area and you are passing this show up, you're an idiot. Or you're a pussy. Or you're a puss idiot. Isn't that a town in New Jersey? I don't know. Anyway, thank you for joining me on this short little journey. And, um, bye.